Hugh Hefner was born in Illinois in 1926 with a passion for women, sex, and journalism. After he was denied a raise at Esquire, he quit and founded his own adult publication in 1953, Playboy Magazine. With a sexy Marilyn Monroe on the cover and the centerfold, Hefner managed to sell 55,000 copies out of his Chicago kitchen in what was basically a huge clickbait scheme. After developing his logo, Hefner also developed his Playboy philosophy, centered around free enterprise and the exploration of sexuality. He wanted to target intellectual, sophisticated men instead of middle-aged men who get aroused by gardening and lawnmowers. His nudity-centered Playboy boomed and soon had clubs all over the world, its own TV show, and an unlimited supply of women. Hefner advocated free expression, abortion rights, and civil rights, making him a pivotal agent in the sexual revolution of the 1960s. However, Hefner promoted a lifestyle that was misogynistic at its core. It hated on women, portraying them as controlling wives and gold diggers, and only saw them as sex objects. Hefner thrived on the horniness of men in his own. He went on to build lavish Playboy mansions, where he locked up hot chicks in an endless torment of abuse and tyranny. Eventually, Hef's heart gave out in 2017, but at least he died happily ever after. Hey guys, don't forget to subscribe and like our shit, and uh, we'll see you soon.